Pregnancy brings so many changes in your body. It can be hard to know if what you're feeling is normal or if it's a problem. If you want to learn more about natural hospital birth, subscribe now. In this video, we'll discuss the main signs to call your doctor during pregnancy. My name is Katie Griffin. I'm a registered nurse, the Moz Certified Childbirth Educator, and the lead educator for COPA Birth. I'm also the mother of six and almost seven. Before we dive into a list of symptoms that could signal trouble, remember that these things don't always mean that something is seriously wrong. So whatever you're experiencing, keep calm and know that most pregnancies result in healthy babies. And I'm not a doctor, so what follows is not medical advice, nor does this cover every possible scenario. Use your common sense and call your doctor anytime you feel it's warranted, whether or not it hits this list. Today we're going to go deeper into the following reasons why you might need to call your doctor a midwife, such as bleeding, painful cramping, severe diarrhea, severe vomiting, high fever, dizziness, pain when urinating, trouble urinating, severe headache, sudden swelling of the hands or face. Let's start with bleeding. Some spotting, especially during the first trimester, is not uncommon and does not usually signal a problem. So what's the difference between spotting and bleeding though? Typically, bleeding is described as being as heavy as or heavier than a menstrual period. Any type of notable bleeding during pregnancy is a valid reason to call your doctor or midwife right away. Painful cramping. You may notice some fleeting abdominal discomfort every now and then, or you may feel a pulling or a dull ache on the sides of your lower abdomen. This is likely stretching of the round ligaments. These are the bands of tissue that support and help hold up your uterus. But signs to call your doctor while pregnant include really sharp pain or pain that isn't relieved by resting or changing position, pain that doesn't go away, a sharp pain on one side, especially in early pregnancy, severe diarrhea or severe vomiting. As you've likely learned, vomiting and diarrhea can happen due to hormone swings in the first trimester. Or maybe you ate something that didn't agree with you. Typically, vomiting and diarrhea aren't harmful to your baby, but one risk is dehydration. So definitely call your doctor if diarrhea persists for more than 24 hours or just keeps returning. Vomiting makes you unable to keep any food or fluids down for more than 24 hours. And if dehydration is a concern, that's another reason to call. Signs of dehydration include dark colored urine or really small amounts of urine, being unable to urinate, an inability to keep down liquids, feeling faint or dizzy when you stand up, and a racing heart, high fever. High temperature for long periods of time can be harmful to your baby, especially in the first trimester. So a temperature of 102 degrees or higher is always a sign to call your doctor. In the meantime, try a lukewarm shower, drink plenty of fluids, and consult with your doctor about any medications you can take. Severe dizziness. Dizziness every now and then is not uncommon during pregnancy, and it can be caused by things like changes in circulation, low blood pressure, or even low blood sugar. For occasional or mild dizziness, you should just hydrate, change positions slowly, avoid overheating, things like that. And mention it to your doctor at your next visit, if you don't feel like a call is warranted. However, you should definitely call your doctor if you're experiencing frequent or severe dizziness. If you fainted or had a blackout, dizziness that's accompanied by swelling in your legs, painful urination or trouble urinating. Lots of pregnant moms have to pee frequently, but it's a problem if you feel like you have to pee but you can't, or if it burns when you pee, or there's blood in your urine. These can all be signs of urinary tract infection or other problem and warrant a call to your doctor. Severe headache. Mild headaches are a fairly common pregnancy complaint, especially if you were prone to headaches with your monthly period. However, a severe headache or one that won't go away could signal a problem, like preeclampsia. If you're experiencing pain beyond what you'd consider a normal headache or have long-lasting headaches, it's time to call the doctor. Sudden swelling of the hands or face. Again, swelling is a normal symptom of pregnancy. 75% of pregnant women report swollen fingers, ankles, and feet, so this is generally nothing to worry about. 
However, if you have a rapid, drastic weight gain, like 10 pounds in five days, or you notice sudden swelling, it could signal preeclampsia, which causes water retention. This is a serious condition and you should contact your doctor and midwife right away. Now moms, we want to hear from you. Have you had a situation that warranted a call to the doctor or midwife? Or are there other scenarios that you'd like to add to this list? Please share your experience in the comments below.